But Hochul said that the cancer was found in a small speck in her nose just a few weeks ago, and as a matter of excess uh, precaution, she decided to have it removed immediately. Governor Hochul said her doctor diagnosed the basal cell carcinoma on her nose. It's a form of cancer that tends to grow slowly. And as we learned from noted dermatologist Jody Levine, it is not considered life-threatening. So basal cell carcinoma is the most common form of skin cancer. Uh, accounts for about 80% of skin cancers. And it is a skin cancer of the basal cells, which are the, at the lowest level of the epidermis. It is not serious. The prognosis of the basal cell is excellent. Governor Hochul said she's not the first in her family to be diagnosed with this form of cancer. According to the American Cancer Society, the disease is becoming more common because of increased sun exposure and better skin cancer detection. Basal cells commonly happen from skin ex sun exposure, from UV exposure, and you see them 15 to 20 years down the road. Hochul said she'll be out of commission for about an hour or two to have the cancer removed, and she said she'll return to her office with a bandage in her nose after the procedure. Most commonly, it's done in uh, 10, 20 minutes, a little local injection of numbing, take out the basal cell. With more than 3.5 million cases of basal cell carcinoma diagnosed each year, doctors encourage everyone to get regular checkups. Early detection is key because then it's easy to get rid of your basal cell and there's nothing to worry about.